As expected, the pre-match press conference saw South African captain Faf Du Plessis field more questions about ball tampering than about the fourth and final test at the Wanderers. But the Proteus skipper said he was sympathetic towards the beleaguered Australian captain Steve Smith and reached out to him before his unceremonious departure back to Australia. I did send him a text. Um, as I said, I, I, from a, a really deep place in my heart, I, I feel for the guy. You don't want to see um, guys going through that stuff. Um, and it's going to be incredibly hard for him over the next days. Um, yeah, so I just sent a message of support. The Proteas will field the same 11 that demolished Australia by 322 runs in Cape Town. And Duplessis feels that despite what has transpired with their opponents, his charges will be going all out to rewrite the history books at a venue that has not been a happy hunting ground in the past. I mean, that's what competitors do. They, they want to go in and, and make sure that they, they finish the job. Um, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm expressing what I'm feeling towards a, a, a human being and what he's going through. Um, but it certainly doesn't take away from what we're going to try and achieve as the next, over the next five days. Instead of interim captain Tim Payne, a tearful coach Darren Lehman addressed the media and announced he would be stepping down at the end of the series after five years in charge of the former world champions. After seeing events in the media today with Steve Smith and Cameron Bancroft, um, the feeling is that Australian cricket needs to move forward and this is the right thing to do. I really felt for Steve, and as I saw him crying in front of the media, and all the players are really hurting. Darren Lehman's decision to step down as head coach has caught everyone by surprise. He is yet another victim of the controversial series that has marred what has been a competitive three-match contest until now. And all the noise that has overshadowed what could well be a historic test for South Africa and a game in which they bid farewell to one of their loyal servants, Mornay Morkel. CS2 CGTN, Johannesburg.